Hey there, fellow iPad Pro users. If you've ever noticed faint lingering images on your screen that just won't vanish, you're in for an eye-opening video. I'm diving into a common issue that's been bothering iPad Pro enthusiasts, the mysterious screen burn-in problem. This annoyance can strike when you least expect it, affecting both your productivity and entertainment. Today, we're sharing some essential tips and solutions to keep your iPad Pro screen looking pristine. Before we begin, we would appreciate it if you hit that like button. One of the first steps you can take to address screen burn-in on your iPad Pro is a relatively simple one, restarting your device. Yep, sometimes a good old restart can work wonders in clearing up temporary image retention or ghosting issues on your screen. To restart your iPad Pro, press and hold the power button and either volume button until you see the power off slider. Drag the slider to turn off your device. Once the device is off, wait for a few seconds before turning it on. Check if the screen burn-in issue still occurs. Transition to adjusting brightness levels on your iPad Pro. So, if you're dealing with screen burn-in on your beloved iPad Pro, adjusting the screen brightness can be the key step in combating this issue. Let's explore how you can make the most out of these settings. Locate the brightness controls on your iPad Pro. You will typically find these in the control center, which you can access by swiping down from the top right corner of your screen. Reduce the screen brightness using the brightness slider and check if this minimizes the burn-in effect. Dark mode offers a myriad of benefits, especially when dealing with screen burn-in. Not only does it reduce the strain on your eyes in low light environments, but it also minimizes the effect of persistent images on your screen. Try turning on dark mode from the display and brightness section of your iPad Pro and check if this minimizes the effect of screen burn-in. If other solutions haven't worked and your screen burn-in is too severe to ignore, it might be time to consider a screen replacement. It's a more advanced solution that brings back the vibrant display you love. You can either take your iPad Pro to an authorized Apple service center or a third-party repair center. You can also try to replace the screen yourself if you have the skills and tools. However, replacing the screen yourself may void your warranty and expose your device to other risks, so we do not recommend this option unless you are confident and experienced. Thank you for joining us today to explore the world of troubleshooting iPad Pro screen burn-in issues. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our latest tech tips and solutions.